Well, thanks to Gray for those early races. I'm off stateside for some American jumping. Three and a quarter miles. This one, Grade 1, Cavo Doro at the top. Martin Leon keep the contract. Craig Beck with San Pedro Cartel, Vinnie Gerard. The tree man, Joshua Southern, Union East, John Morgan, Wooden Shipley on Van Rensburg, Frozen Hope, and Habley, Darren Thompson. Nightclubber Craig Beckwith, Queen of the Night, John Morgan, Secret Passageway, Leon Van Rensburg, Sierra Vista, Medusa, Vinnie Gerard, The Widow, Joshua Sutherland, and Witness Mischief for James Shea. So 14 of them then, and away and racing. A very short run of the first, and they all got over it okay. And... We've got a couple of John Morgan horses in this. I expect to see them going off quickly. They're over the second already. And one of those John Morgan horses, Union East, is in the lead. Uh, Union East it is then. He's opened up by four lengths already. The Cavo Doro in second. Then the Tree Man. And Secret Passageway, Queen of the Night after that one. That's the second John Morgan. I don't think that one's so much of a front runner. Uh, maybe Union East is in there to tow the field along. It's not gone quite so well this week for John Morgan with his front runners, two of them falling and certainly in the race at Warwick on day one rather than the race earlier today you could see what difference it makes when you've got a horse that goes off really quickly because the race totally changed if you haven't seen that race and you haven't got a horse in it go back and watch it because whilst the John Morgan horse was in the lead and clear, oh there's a faller there and it's Cavo Doro, it's mine so it serves me right for waffling but anyway go back and look at it because when the John Morgan horse was leading and sitting at a strong pace there was about 25 lengths from first to last as soon as that horse fell the field just concertinaed in and there was only about eight lengths between first and last for the rest of the race so it definitely makes a difference and I think it also leads to more fallers as well because they must make some errors when they're jumping but anyway back to this one they're coming into the fifth and Union East lands in the lead from Queen of the Night second, the Tree Man third, in Secret Passageway, and the Widow, and keep the contract towards the back San Pedro Cartel. Here's the back marker as they get over the next one or two mistakes there, most notably from Sierra Vista, uh, sorry, Secret Passageway, the Leon Van Rensburg horses, they get over the next, and they're all safely over that one. Wooden ship towards the rear as well. That is Union East in the lead. 1 2 for John Morgan. Oh, they're six lengths apart. Union East in the lead. Queen of the Night second. Then the Widow and the Tree Man with Keep the Contract and Night Club. So it's two John Morgans, two Joshua Sutherlands, followed by two Craig Beckwiths. And if that Vinnie Gerard was dropped back a little bit, we'd then have two Darren Thompsons as well. And then we go to this side, we'd have two Leon Van Rensburg. So they're almost. We're in team racing at the moment as they get over that next one. With the Union East in the lead, the Widow and Queen of the Night. And the Tree Man, keep the contract, is next. And Sierra Vista Medusa, and Nightclub. Habley and Frozen Hope, Wooden Ship, and Secret Passageway. And then finally, San Pedro Cartel and Witness Mischief is now just the back marker. James Shea, the only trainer left in the race with only one horse in it. Nobody else has got two. The only other person who had one in it was me and mine's long gone. And it's Union East in front. From the Widow and the Tree Man. As they get to the ninth of the 17. And Union East it is who leads. In by three lengths as they get to the tenth. We'll safely over the tenth. Don't say anything's out of this yet, apart from the four, of course. As they get over the next. We'll safely over that. The Union is continuing to lead the widow and the tree man racing together in second. And keep the contract and Sierra Vista Medusa Queen of the Night on the inside. Night clover close up to that horse there or thereabouts that one in Habberley his next secret passageway San Pedro Cartel getting a bit closer Frozen Hope after that 
as they make their way towards the final mile of the race then they're going to come past the tinted village type thing as they get over the 12th and Union East has been in the lead all the way and continues to lead as they get over that one and San Pedro Cartel's gone there and San Pedro Cartel a faller and Union East is still the leader from nightclub on the outside Sierra Vista Medusa is third then the widow and queen of the night then comes keep the contract and the tree man and your secret passageway wooden ship on the wide outside Habily and Frozen Hope trying to get into it as well but Frozen Hope's a couple of lengths adrift of the rest of them now as Union East kicks on again in the lead Union East then by two lengths to nightclubber in second this is the 14th over it they go and it's still Union East in front just three more to get over then now from look at this witness mischief he was last a second ago and now he's right through into second wooden ship is also coming through with a strong looking run so secret passageways they get over the third last and over that one they went and it's Union East who's in the lead from secret from witness mischief in second wooden ship is third secret passageway four as they get over the second last and they're beginning to bunch up top now and nightclub had to be snatched up there got nowhere to go at all he's got a double handful on that horse but he can't get a gap and it's wooden ship who's now taking it up wooden ship's gone into the lead from witness mischief in second then comes secret passageway union east is next nightclub has been pulled off the fence to try and come through with a run the tree man is next queen of the night and the widow have got work to do they're racing down towards the final fence and secret passageway has hit the front now he's got clear daylight on nightclubber they race down towards this final fence secret passageways in the lead nightclubber is in second the tree man is third over the final fence they go and it's secret passageway in the lead secret passageway is well clear and he's got a hold on and take it secret passageway wins it nightclubber a very unlucky second then the tree man third sierra vista juice was fourth then queen of the night the widow and union east and secret passageway enhances claims for the Gold Cup at Cheltenham in a couple of weeks, but Nightclubber has run a good race there and was very unlucky. Totally boxed in when he was about to make his run. Whether he'd have run the leader down, I don't know, but it's certainly unlucky and bodes well for Cheltenham in a couple of weeks. Secret Passageway, the winner though, for Leon Van Rensburg will no doubt be happy with it. All his horse as well. Nightclubber second for Craig Beckwith, the tree man for Joshua Sutherland was third. Fourth was Sierra Mr. Medusa for Vinnie Gerard and Queen of the Night for John Morgan was fifth.